because I am going to be doing a new route that was discovered recently. I know the game just came out, but yeah, you you would expect, um, you know, a game like Undertale, Deltarune to kind of have a neutral, a true pacifist, and a genocide. Um, thing about Deltarune Chapter 2 is it's, quote unquote, it's not really a genocide route, it sort of is. Uh, it's unlocked in a very unconventional way, and so I'm going to be doing that, so let's start. Uh, kill. Yes, I will start the game as kill. I have to go to, through the character creator. I don't. Yes, I am awake. And yes, I do have a knife. No! What's up, Peanut? Alright, yes. I did eat all the pie. I'm gonna kinda... Kind of blaze through it at first, um, just for the sake, like, when we start getting into, like, the new stuff, I will actually, uh, go ahead and do that. I want to make sure, um, okay, yeah, weapon it, or pencil and the bandage. I do actually have the same, or, like, initial starting equipment. There we go, yes. made it actually yeah I'm literally just gonna mash through and get to the good stuff I do think I'm actually gonna speed run chapter 2 today I'm really thinking about it I'm actually really thinking about it all right Susie let's go We're going to the dark world. And of course, we're doing crime. We're going to jail. So yeah, the, the genocide route kind of starts a little bit of ways into the, uh, the new dark world. Get the ball of junk on our head. Right? Our boy! Oh, didn't mean to interact with the cauldron, but... Susie's room. Yo, what up, Cuddy? Hey, you know, it's going good. I, um, I woke up today at, like, 1 in the morning. But, um, uh, yeah, I mean, other than that, we're good. Uh, is there any specific reason why I decided to have long hair? Haven't been able to cut your hair due to COVID. It was extremely uncomfortable. I was trying to get used to the thought of having long hair. Um, 
Um, to be completely honest, at first it was to spite a girlfriend at the time. Um, because I had a side shave and she used to talk shit about it all the time. So I was like, you know what, fuck it. I'm literally just gonna shave my head and then I'm just gonna grow it. I'm gonna fucking grow it and grow it and grow it and, you know, that's it. You know, it's just gonna become whatever it becomes. But then, as I got through this sort of like awkward stage that everybody has when, you know, you're growing out your hair, especially if you have curly hair like me, um, it started to, uh, whatchamacallit? Like, I actually started to really like it. And now it's actually where I feel the most comfortable with myself. I mean, yeah, my hair kind of looks like shit today, but, um, uh, it really is like how I feel the most comfortable with myself. But, um, I am going to trim it a little bit later. In a little bit. Can't stand when, when, uh, when your hair touches your ears. I mean, I, I don't blame you. Alright, so we're gonna go... The only thing is it, it, the hair kind of annoys me when I'm sleeping, but it's not too bad, you know? We got Hot Lancer. Alright, time to fight. So yeah, we're just gonna kill, traditionally. Ba, ba, ba. Damn it. It's actually the first time I've killed an enemy, so I've never seen the lost text. So I did completely true pacifist. On my first playthrough. I'm choking these these hits. Alright. See, I've I've thought about um you know, having really short hair. But um you know the thing with that is I'm definitely gonna need, uh, or I don't know. I want to keep my hair while I have it, you know? So if I cut it, will I be able to grow it back if I want it? And yeah, this is pretty much the Undertale sequel. Like, if you haven't noticed, Deltarune is literally Undertale, but you rearrange the letters. I wonder if you have to kill all the enemies. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna go ahead. I'm not entirely sure. But I will actually kill all the enemies. There is a point that we need to kill all the enemies. I'm not sure. I, I actually don't think... I'm gonna say that I don't think it's, like, these enemies, but I'm gonna do it anyways. Oh, okay, it's recommended to level up the character. Okay, yeah, that's fine. That's cool. Thanks, kitty. Yeah, I know the point where, like, you actually, like, have to start killing, but yeah, it's, uh, definitely a good idea. Considering I haven't spoiled the route for myself yet. I just know how it's set up. And then I, I, I didn't look at anything afterwards. Um. Oh, wait. I'm going the wrong way, but that's fine. Yeah, 
Yeah, all I know is it's fucked up. So I'm, uh... I'm so down. I need to go over here. Oh, wait. Oh. This isn't the screen that I was thinking it was. I did it. Oh. Fucking Newbert. Wait. I don't know where I'm going, actually. <laughs> See, th this is pretty much the warm-up for when I speedrun. Yeah, I don't think you have to salt that apple. Alright. <laughs> he like, referred to his Guitar Hero combat. You know, it, it's like a bullet hell. You dodge in, sometimes it becomes a shoot em up. And now it's actually gonna be Punch Out. <laughs> so, so, yeah. Alright, let's go. So it's two, dodge, oh shit. You can dodge down. Okay. I didn't know if you could dodge, dodge punches by going down. Yeah, what's up, dragon? I don't know, I don't know. Wait, yeah, this doesn't matter. Actually, what happens if you select perish? Oh, wait, no. I uh, bosom would have been the other option. Yeah, I select to perish in my casual playthrough. Agree to all. <laughs> Shit! What's up, Opt again? I'm doing pretty good. I'm pretty dang good. Uh, minus my sleep schedule, but you know that that's kind of the norm at this point. All right, time to dance. Actually, wait. I don't think you can kill this. Oh, wait, no, it's just faster in the run to, to spare this one. And also, you kill Chris here. I've seen that. But I'm gonna kill. But it's asleep, I wish- well, actually, I, I'm sleeping a shit ton, it's just at the complete wrong time. Oh, wait, maybe you have to- oh, you have to spare. Oh. Okay. Alright. Ow. Ow. 
I love how these lightning attacks go to the music. Alright, so, yeah, hey, can you just teach each other how to dance? Oh, shit. Dude, I have just, like, taken hits left and right. <laughs> I wonder if starting this turn at a specific point in the music makes it faster or slower. Alright. Y'all need to learn how to dance. is dancing. Pulling out all the Charlie Brown. not buy anything yet. And not yet. I wonder, can you just straight up kill Birdly? I know he's pacified in the run, as of right now, or from what I saw, but... I guess we'll find out! Alright, 
Uh, join. <laughs> Being attacked by good grades. Oh wait, I think Susie has Red Buster. Or Rude Buster, yeah. Okay, and then Bradley. <laughs> Alright, we're about to get to the part where things are gonna get interesting. Where it really gets different. Oh, Susie, you're hurt. You shall be healed with the power of hugging. In here. Our candy. I will take some healing. Doesn't matter what you pick. I'll always be left alone. Alright, the city is actually where things get spicy. No. Oh. <laughs> I'll just... Let's slow it down. Oh, fuck. <laughs> God. <laughs> In here. 20. Pop up. I close pop ups? No, I can't. Okay. Oh, CD bagel, okay. I'll take it. All right, so getting Noel. Now this is where the fun begins. To... Okay, so here, let me, let me just hit a save. All right, 
Backtrack to the zone and interact with the door furthest left. Yeah, the Spampton shop. On your way back, defeat every enemy with Noel using only the ice ability. Which Chris can do damage, but Noel has to just do the killing blow. You will know you are still on the run when the rooms are, are filled with enemies and no cars appear. Kill every enemy with the ice attack. Block with Chris. Use only the ice attack. Continue this process until you reach the room with the Ferris wheel poster. And once you make it to this room with the Ferris wheel, just do the following in this order. Kill the enemies with ice. Interact with the Ferris wheel. Choose ride with Noel. And select Noel will ride with me. The only MP yeah, go to the only NPC in the room. Okay. Alright. So, let's just get to there. Yeah, Chris, isn't this the wrong way? Somehow I'm already regretting this. Alright, so... I'm just... <laughs> What's going on? What are we doing? I'm going to defend... The wall became stronger. Frozen solid. Large event is going to happen in these streets later. I'm told to make room for some- oh yeah, this is the same dialogue. stronger. I can't go up. Chris, are you sure this isn't the wrong way? Raid War Dog. How's it going? Alright. Kill every enemy. Continue until you reach the room with the Ferris wheel poster. Or wait, I thought I was supposed to go to this. Do I have to go? Chris, why did you bring me here? No one's home. No one's around at all. So creepy. At the same time, it, it's kind of nostalgic. Alright, so now we gotta find the Ferris wheel poster. Yo, it's going pretty good, War Dog! Wait. Oh yeah, I was like, that's not a door. Yeah, you know, it, it, it is going pretty good, just, uh... Been hanging out with Deltarune recently. You now this game is a, uh, big trip. Alright, there's no cars, that's good. That is a sign. You would think these plus signs would heal you. Heard of the Echo Espad? I, I I think it's cool that you know it's being made. Um, 
Honestly, I'm not like super interested in it, but I do think it's cool that, you know, it's made. All right, wait. On the way back. Yeah, kill every enemy. So you reached the Ferris wheel poster. Okay, so I haven't reached it yet. Oh, I, I did it wrong. Did it wrong. Whoops. Hey, you got to Midgar? Nice. Yeah, I ho hope you've been having a good time with it. Ow. Oh, yeah, let me just run into that real quick. The Ferris wheel poster is coming up, I think. No, I was like, why am I killing everyone? So this is the Ferris wheel. But I don't think this is the posters. It might just be later in the room. I do have to continue to kill every enemy in this room though, so. Dude, FF7 Remake on PC is gonna be so sick. Yeah, just with all the modding potential and whatnot. Having fun? Yes. My fun value is 99. I just want to make sure. Or anybody to kill here. Wait, actually, let me uh, try to interact with this. Yeah, advertisement for a giant Ferris wheel. Yeah, choose Ride with Noel. And then Noel will ride with me. Gosh, that's amazing. Well, the festival looked like a toy. Wonder if Susie would want to. Gosh, who am I kidding? Yeah, I will ride with you. Oh, so you can shake him when we reach the top? Just like at the festival when we were kids? I know there's a catch with you, Chris. No, thanks. Oh, well, will ride with me. Huh? I mean, sure, if you uh, really want to, you can make up for when we were kids. When did Chris get so... No oh, way. Must be some kind of prank. Okay. Go to the only NPC in the room and say you... or something more. When the NPC... or... Stops you when you walk away. You get it until you 
get the, the first ring. Ah, oh, two young beings together on a school night. Can I interest you in some brand new dating shoes? Huh? No, 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 no. You got it totally wrong. Chris and I are friends. Uh, Chris has been my neighbor forever. Been through so much. Sometimes it feels like we know each other better than anyone. And somehow it's hard to say we're exactly friends. Yeah, we're something else. Now, what does that mean? There's no good interpretation, that's for sure. Are you two? Oh, wait. And some brand new divorcing shoes. Yeah. Something else. Maybe a dating shoes isn't right. Maybe I could interest you in a freeze ring? Uh, a ring? <laughs> Sorry, I think we need... We don't need something like that. Come on, Angel. Can't get stronger without good equipment. Stronger? Right, I, I guess that's how it works here. Chris buying me a ring? Yeah, right. Get it. Chris, you'd buy it for me? Sure, I guess. I could ask about it. How much does it cost? Uh, conveniently, one more dollar than what I have. Uh, sorry, we don't have that much money. Well, it was nice of Chris to offer. Get it. M me? You were asking me to get it? Uh, Chris, come on. You know we can't afford that. Get it. What? Chris, I just told you we don't have the money. What are you asking me to do? You aren't asking me to just... Get it. Chris, no, I, not me. I could never... Get it. I... Oh shit. Oh fuck. You got the freeze ring. What just happened? Did I actually just... No, they... They must have given it to us. The ring. Besides, it's good to get stronger, isn't it? Thanks, Chris. Alright. So. Now. Equip the ring. If you did this right, the music should change to a lower pitch version of the city theme. Probably when I zone out. In the same room, you will encounter two switches with Lightning Gale. Yeah, the two switches, yeah. Noelle will offer to step on the switch so you can pass on like a normal run where you do it. Afterwards, she says she's considered letting go. And respond with that's natural. When you step on the switch, the lightning comes back. But I hold it down and you go across. Nice teamwork. You know all? Nothing bad is going to happen. Getting that ring was good, wasn't it? Stop thinking about it. Stop thinking about stepping off the switch and... Letting Chris get... Oh well, no, don't think that. It's horrible. It's natural. Chris, what are you talking about? I must have said that out loud. Okay. Continue to the next part of the run where you encounter the second mouse puzzle. Noel will ask you how you're going to solve it. Solve it. Say proceed. Until she freezes the puzzle over. She will then do this with the third puzzle as well. Kill all enemies with only Noel's ice attack. In the large room with two tall car roads, you can optionally go down to the dog dumpster area. On the right, far down the road, really to check how many fights you still need. Let's say four left. You're on pace.
while the boxes aren't there. Oh, and I guess the queen isn't here either. Shock. Oh, fuck. I should touch a save point. Fuck. Oh, a Noel animation. No, no, we're filled with power. It's a box. Box filled with bagels. Take one. Sure. I like how it runs away from me. Actually, I guess I could just see what's in the box. Bounce blade. This is just a big loop around, I think. Either way, I do need to make sure all enemies die. Yo, what's up, Zoo? Oh, yeah. I think this was just an alternate pathway that area yeah okay how am i feeling i'm doing okay uh my my sleep is completely effed but i'm not doing too bad hope you're doing good <laughs> literally they run away from you now oh my god that's great Oh shit, he's swerving. Never seen him swerve. So yeah, this is chapter two of the Undertale sequel. Well, or it's not Undertale, but there are many reasons to believe they are connected. So one, one thing that's like, you know, easily apparent, well, I guess not easily apparent, but yeah, if you rearrange the letters of Deltarune, you can spell Undertale. You can also spell Nut Dealer. Or Unrelated. That's another one. for interesting deal. I'll shut your mouth because you are a weakling. Try a little Friday night workout, then I'll show you my... I'll show you my... four left. Okay. I could do the secret. You equip Noel's watch to Chris. She gets less defense. This won't mess up. Like, is this only for the, the bad ending? Yeah, just this one? Okay. Does, does it kind of like enrich? Does it enrich the experience? You think it does? Does it get rid of anything that's also good? Because I don't mind doing it twice. 
Or does it just add to the experience? Because if it, if it just adds something, then yeah. I might end up... Or I don't know. We'll, we'll see what's going on. But, uh... It seems like it adds. All right. Honestly, I am down. Yeah, pr appreciate the heads up on that. Yeah, I got four left. Yeah, so I got that guy. All right, I just want to make sure. All right, so there's four left. Otherwise, backtrack more about enemies. In the next three rooms, there will be four enemies. Kill them all with Noel and return to the dumpster. Talk to it, say yes by the second ring. You must equip it for Birdly. Okay. Start a slightly hard look. This fight, Noel has a new spell that costs 100 TP. Let's use it to end the fight. Don't focus on healing. Alright, so I'm almost locked into the path to where I can remain spoiler free. Okay. So I can just say proceed. <laughs> Look, Chris, another puzzle. How should we solve it? Proceed. Go. Uh, how? There's nowhere to go. Chris, there, the path is blocked, isn't it? Proceed. Chris, what are you doing? Is everything okay? Proceed. Chris, there's lightning in the way. If we move any further, I'll... I'll be... Chris, you didn't really hear what I said earlier, did you? You, you wouldn't let me... Proceed. Chris? Proceed. There! Looks like I did it! I just listened to Chris's command. Somehow before I knew it, the puzzle was finished. What was I thinking? Chris wasn't trying to hurt me. They were just making me stronger. Yes. Oh, there's no cheese! <laughs> yeah, Mouse, you can't run away. Oh, shit. Da -da -da -da. That's two. Like how the music is like happy. Or maybe this is still the pitch shifted one. Alright, wait. Let me see. What's up, shield? Alright, in the next three rooms, there will be four enemies. Wait. 
you will do this with a third puzzle. Remember, you must kill the enemies. Or wait, 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 wait. Hold up. Because apparently boss fight isn't right here. I'm gonna go back and make sure it just says two left. I'm pretty sure I'm still fine. Yeah, I found out about this last night and I was like, oh shit, I gotta do it. Say two left. I'll show you my. Yeah, two left. Okay. I just don't want to go too far and accidentally hit the birdly boss fight early. We are proceeding. I'll go ahead and do the puzzle. Isn't it a good thing? Solving things by myself. Taking new things for myself. Defeating enemies by myself. And every time I do it, getting stronger. What did I do when we got that ring? When I solved that puzzle? It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter if I can't remember. It doesn't matter if the battles are blurring together. If Chris tells me to do it, I can do things I could never do before. Isn't it a good thing? I'm getting stronger. As long as I do what they say. As long as I... I also think there was an item there that I could have picked up. Oh, that's fine, whatever. All finished. Chris, uh, should we find some more enemies? <laughs> there is no escape from Noelle. So these are the final two, and then we go back. Yeah, we're gonna go back and get the next ring. Yeah, me too, shield. Me too. Yeah, dude. If only we could just get everything all at once. Angel. Angel. Are you looking for the ring of thorns? Yes. That'll be 1997 Cromer. Yes. Here's your ring. Careful. It might sting. <laughs> Got the thorn ring. Don't worry. For our no, no money back guarantee, this is one purchase you will regret for the rest of your life. Oh fuck. Yeah, the thorn ring has trance. Where it takes pain. Yeah. Alright, so now... Almost finished if the birdling must say proceed when he asks what you are doing. 
This will start a slightly harder fight. Alright. Noelle has a new spell. You end you must end the fight with the, the 100 TP spell. But you won't have to heal. Okay. But yeah, I, th I think I just equipped it. Yeah, I did. Okay. Alright, so now I'm at the point where I won't have to read notes. I just continue, because like, one once I get done with this fight, I'm locked in. Here, Birdly, waiting for you. Uh, 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 Noel, there you are. Uh, uh, Just in time. We can both go back to the queen and. Uh, Noel? Chris, it looks like another enemy. Did I freeze them? Uh, 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 Noel? Uh, Noelle, it's me! Uh, don't you recognize me? <laughs> b birdly uh, uh, Noelle! You okay? Uh, uh, what are you doing with Chris? Uh, I'm just... Uh, we're... just... Getting stronger. Getting stronger? How? Uh, Chris, what are you doing? Proceed. What? Proceed? Where? Well, uh, what are they talking about? That's it, Chris. I'll, uh, I don't know what you're doing. But if you're hurting my friend Noel... I have no choice but to stop you by force! Chris, ready yourself. Wait, Birdly, stop! Run away! Fatal. Alright, I'm gonna just defend until I have 100 TP. Oh. Okay, so the arrows now have multiple directions. Okay, I'm at max DP. Snow grave. This is a snow grave. I don't know what that spell. I'm telling you, I I don't know what you're talking about. I'm telling you, stop! I don't know what you're talking about. Fine. You wanna see what happens so bad? Watch what happens when I cast a spell I don't know! Go well, cast Snowgrave. Oh, fuck. He dead. What? What happened? There was so much snow, I couldn't see anything. I... I don't feel so good. I think... I'm going to go home. Just peacing out? Alright, this is the point of no return after getting... After getting the scene, you're locked on the path. Continue to play normally. 
Okay. Start to see through the ice. Alright, so, yeah! Oh, it is a shine! Good point. That's funny. The manhole. The ladder leading inside. Climbed into the manhole. Oh shit. Here we are. <laughs> Looks like we finally found the fountain. Yeah, but where the hell is Chris? Hi. Chris! Where the hell were you? We were searching everywhere for you. Even Susie was worried. No, I wasn't. Just, you know, tell us if you're gonna... Hey, Chris. You, uh... Okay. You look kinda... Chris, if you're hurt, Susie can heal you. That's right. I'm a healing master now, Chris. Even better than Rousey, so... If, uh... You hurt yourself or something, then... You try doing a hug like I did earlier. Shut up and let's just go already. Okay, new music. Huh? Isn't this... Oh, that guy from before. I saw a statue of him. It's not a statue, Susie. Huh? See, each dark fountain creates a different world. A world whose darkness reflect the will of its fountain. But though those darkness can exist in their own worlds, they might not belong if they go to another one. Huh? So if we just bring him back to the castle town... Do we, uh, have to do that? Uh, yeah. Whatever. Alright, Squall. It's terrible. The butlers are all trapped in the cafe. Queen is nowhere to be found, and... With no one to defend it, a strange force has taken over the mansion. Alright, so... Okay, it's gonna limit me to this shortcut, I think. I think it's gonna be only the shortcut. Oh. Locked. Whoa, you saucy little sponge, you. Don't barge in when a man is changing forms. Wait, wait. One second. Is that my esteemed customer? Thank you to that little Hochi Mama. I'm living big. And I'll have everyone in this city eating right out of my money. <laughs> I sure hope no one seals the fountain around now. <laughs> I sure hope. I sure hope. Kid, I'm busy becoming God. Go play Minecraft or something. <laughs> It's not my job to be some kid's extra boss. Actually, yeah, it is. Alright, well... Wait, did I save? I'm just gonna save again, just in case. Alright, um... Yeah, I can just proceed as normal. I'm gonna... I'm gonna shit the bed, apparently. Oh, really? I'm dodging that one for some reason. Yeah, 
honestly, that's the thing that I really like about Undertale. I mean, the fact that its battle system can be so expressive with the personality of the enemies, but also, like, I'm actively engaged, like, the whole time, you know? Like, it's not just, like, mindless, like, doing turns back and forth. Alright. I became stronger. Okay, so... Alright, let's bring up the Bounce Blade. I only have Amber cards. Okay. I'm gonna kill everything just to become stronger. Closed. Yeah, what's up, Vlad? Appreciate the luck. I feel like I'm gonna need it. Oh, what? Oh. Yeah, these are the things from, uh, Spamton. Let's see, I'm only getting money, right? Here, I'm gonna... I'm just gonna see if there's anything. Let's see if there's anything. Alright, doesn't appear to be anything. Oh, well, fuck me. If I got experience, I would seriously clear out this whole room. Oh, fuck. I tried to just inch up a little bit higher. Oh, dude. I think the concept of this route existing is so fucking cool. This is just gonna lead to a dead end wall. But, for the sake of trying, I want to do it. Okay. Alright. What? I didn't even move to the side. I hate everything. God. No, I tried to just... I had a feeling that was gonna happen, but... I believe we're home free. Yeah, there's nothing else here. Okay. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Hold up. Retreat. <laughs> it's like, oh shit. <laughs> okay.
All right, it sucks that I had to waste that. I have to do something without food later on, like a super boss without any food. That would, uh, oh God, that would be tragic. What's up, Drofig? All right, wait, no, that is actually the way to go. Can I go, oh, yep, of course. All right, come here. I wanna fight you. Come here. Oh, you're just these guys. Okay. Ow. All right, so yeah, this is gonna be locked. Yep, can't even interact with it. I'm gonna die. Alright, uh. Oh shit. I should get rid of the cat first. Okay. Actually, wait, what is the HP? Yeah. Okay. Oh my god, really? Oh god, it's like, oh, it's far. Oh shit. Dude, it's like, it doesn't necessarily represent the shit. Okay. Oh god. Okay. I oh got the lights flickered, that was weird. Oh my god, how, how, how? Oh. Alright, well it's gonna die. That's who's still dead. Ah. Okay. Can I get a save point, please? Coffee. All right, please give me a safe point. Okay, all right. You still sell me stuff? Familiar looking statue, fuck. And I have some healing items. straight into that. Wait, I can... I could have been rude bustering before. Oh. 
Okay. Okay. Here. Oh shit. Huh? Hey, it says this is Noelle's room. Chris, let's go in and save her. And, uh, you know, be sure to not get in our way. Chris? Fine, I'll do it myself. Chris? Don't you wonder how they're doing in there? Uh, I said, don't you wonder? How Noelle and Susie are doing? You're right, Chris. It's only been 30 seconds. I'll wait a minute first. Aw. Alright, let's go. Uh, wait, what? Wait, we're supposed to... Hey, let's go. Wait, 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 Susie. What, um, happened in there? Uh, what do you mean, what happened? Uh, in there, with Noel. Nothing. Nothing? Nothing at all? I told her everything is a dream. Now she's feeling better. Anything else? No, oh, and let's go. I'll tell you later, Chris. <laughs> oh, as long as Susie's happy, right? Alright, so what I want to do is... Oh, okay, so there, there was nothing here. What, any sort of secret in here? No. Alright. Yeah, we still got the little dodgy dodgies. Ow. Got correct. Alright. I'm gonna use the restroom real quick before we do this because I don't know what the fuck is gonna happen and I think it's gonna be a really hard boss fight. So, uh, yeah. Give me just, uh, one sec, okay? Okay. Nothing. Oh God. The night. The roaring night. Hey. Dying to create this world. Reaching its long hand to the sky, forced its will into its blade, and made, thrusting the fountain from the earth. Fortunately, the world they cre created 
trapped within the confines of the library. If only we had a way to make more darkness, we might be able to cover the whole world. That is when I realized this power, power of the will, power of determination, is not something that all lightners possess. One was simply determined enough could not anyone make a dark fountain? So then, the night has taken its leave, and I will simply make a new one. But here I am, still empty-handed in my quest. The well is in no condition to assist me now. He must rest. And Bird Boy? I searched for him for ages, but my sensors cannot detect him anywhere. How thoughtful you two have come to help me. Chris, Susie. One of you wants to be the new knight. Get out of our way. Noel needs to wake up. Wake? No. It's already awakened. Too much. Let her close her eyes and sleep away. But darker, darker dream. Okay. Am I going to have to fight this? Now which one of you wants to help me cover the world in darkness? Queen, why? Why do you want to unleash the roaring so much? What is that? Um, the roaring? Yeah, that. What is that? If too much darkness is released, titans will emerge from the fountain, destroy everything, and all darkners will turn into statues. And all lightners will be lost in eternal chaos. <laughs> Holy circuits, are you serious? You really didn't know that? No. <laughs> okay. Well, my plans are shot. My one idea to help Noel failed. Go on, Chris. Seal the fountain. I will not stay in your way any longer. Uh, hey, hey, wait. You don't have to, I mean, uh, it doesn't have to be goodbye, you know. Error. <laughs> I have no idea what you're talking about. We have our own dark world. You can stay there, you know. Who knows? Maybe someday you'll even get to meet Noel again? Really? Uh, maybe. A fatal exception. Sweet. And oh, hell yeah, dot exe. Dizzy, I knew you were a nice girl. Hey, uh, I, I'm just... Chris, go seal the fountain. I... I'm gonna go see Noel before you do. Uh, Chris, I, I'll tell Queen about our town. Chris, I look forward to being your wacky roommate. Chris, the fountain is waiting for you. Amazing. So I can turn your castle into my mansion? Wait, that, that, that's not what I'm saying. Alright. They give you a save point right here. Ever convenient. Oh, is this a shop? Oh, shit. One bagel is... Okay, so let's just buy... Let's buy up. I'm literally just gonna buy all my space. Okay. Here, I'll make a save. Oh shit. <laughs> it was as if your very soul was glowing. Not! <laughs> Alright! You're back! 
Let me say. Let me say thanks. Thanks to your total jackass stunts, I have become Neo. And now it's my mansion, my city, my world. Why are you stealing the fountain? You fuck me over at the good part? What are you, a game show host? Ah, kid, forget it. I'm an honest man. I'll let you pay your way out of this one. Hey. With your rapidly shrinking life. <laughs> Alright, so... We've got Big Shot Fight. I've been kind of going genocide route-like, so... Oh wait. I know that I know the cheat. I know the cheat. I'm gonna do the cheat. Oh wait shit. Yeah, so if you hold, if you hold either Z or Enter and tap the other one, you can, you can rapid fire. I'm probably gonna die. Give you my commemorative ring for the price of my favorite year. Okay, I'm actually gonna heal. This is how you repay me? Treating me like DLC? <laughs> it's so cheap. No, I get it. It's you and that hoochie mama. You've been making, haven't you? You've been making hyperlink blocked. And now that you have your own supply, you don't need me. Oh shit. Oh shit. I was too trusting, too honest. I've always been a man of Pepis, a real Pepis person. No, you see, now we, now we're actually a big shot, okay? We're actually big shotting. It's hard to like do movement and do it at the same time though. Not gonna lie. All right, I, I gotta, I gotta fight. Making frozen chicken with your side chick. Gonna let you drink up that sweet, sweet freedom sauce. Alright, cool. Alright, uh... Oh, you're right. But don't blame me. When you're crying in a broken home wishing you let your old pal Spamton kill you. Oh god. Okay. I'm probably still gonna die. Is it for you? No, it's for me. Okay. I wonder if that'll get patched. The taste of Spamton. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Don't you want to be a big shot? Oh my god. I'm gonna die. Okay. All 
All right, let's run it back. Now it's time to be a true big shot. I have... Okay, I'm actually going to toss dark candy. Or I guess use it. Or... Okay. All right, let's go. It's time to be a big shot. <laughs> when you were just a lost little sponge looking at the bottom of a dumpster. Oh shit. Alright, what are my ac- X slash. You can heal. Oh, you can heal pretty big with- Okay. Everything I have by life advice. Okay, yeah, I've seen this. Oh, wait. Oh, god. I, yep, you definitely don't want to charge shop to this one. I love the use of other Undertale songs. In, in this. I actually think I'm just gonna use the TP heal every time. Okay. Here, wait. Let me just see. Oh, it does physical damage. X slash does do physical damage. Okay. Well, trip. That's what you're gonna say, Vlad. Um. Oh, yeah, 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 honestly for you, Knight, I've just been doing dailies. I've pretty much only been doing da dailies. Oh, wait, oh, I want to do the TP move, whatever. Oh, God. I'm dead. Oh my god. Okay. Now I can be a big shot. Oh. That is good damage. Alright, I've seen that. Oh god. This is it's a nice round. Oh god. All right, nice. God, this is actually the, the hardest phase. Okay. Alright, I kind of actually... What's his health at? It's at 32. I'm actually gonna... I'm gonna heal. Okay. That was good. Now... 
clown. No, I feel sick. All right, good. My X slash, yeah. Also known as cross slash. Don't you want to be a big shot? Is it for you? Yep. All right. Yeah, I'll definitely do this fight without doing this sometime, but I really just want to see what this route's all about. Oh. My esteemed customer, I see you are attempting to deplete my HP. I'll admit, you've got some guts, kid. But in a one-for-one -one battle, Neo never loses. It's time for a little blue light special. Wait, what's DM skip? <laughs> attack rose, de attack drop, defense rose greatly. And you know, Neo is famous for high defense. Now enjoy the fireworks, kid. Do I have a new act? Uh, Rousey? Let's call for help. But nobody came. He knew it! Oh, it's a Kingdom Hearts reference, okay. What? Calling friends? Think you could beat me with your friends? Magic? Go ahead, kid. Call all you want. No one will ever pick up. Alright, that's actually not like a bad move. Let's call for help. But nobody came. Go ahead, scream into the receiver. The voice of Ender runs out eventually. Your voice, their voice. Realize you are all alone. Susie! Chris called for help, but nobody came. There will be no more miracles, no more magic. You lost it when you tried to see too far. You lost it. Just call for help, but nobody came. You make me sick! Muttering your lost friend's names at the bottom of a dumpster. No one's gonna help you. Get that through your beautiful head, you little worm. Jill come for me. He whispered Noelle's name. Her? You're still trying to use her? You think she can hear you? Muttering her name? What's she gonna do? Make an ice cream? Hey, is it cold in here or is it just me? Uh, Birdly's alarm. A dream? It was really just a. Uh... Dizzy? Dizzy, wh what are you doing here? Uh. You invited us to study, remember? Oh, right, I did, didn't I? <laughs> uh, you're in a good mood. Did you, uh, have a good dream? It was a nightmare. Oh. I'm just happy I woke up. The end was nice, though. What happened? Uh, well, um... Hey, Birdly, time to get up and go. Bro, is he dead? Birdly. And gosh, uh, you've been starting too much, Birdly. Honestly, you deserve a little rest, you know? Sweet dreams. Oh, what are you doing? I, you don't have a tail, do you, Susie? Bro, they totally banged. 
Uh, no way, of course not. Really? Uh, that's great. That was weird, Chris. Oh, it doesn't feel like we just saved the world. Chris, hey, wait a sec, Chris. We, we just actually saved the world, didn't we? Damn, we really are heroes. No one even knows. Guess it's better this way though, right? People would freak out if we knew the world's in danger. Oh, kinda sucks Noella has to forget too. Whatever, let's get out of here. He doesn't seem to be awake. He's fucking dead. Or you left, you gathered up everything in the room. Love reading books, especially the books upstairs. Yeah, uh, same dialogue. Man, it got late, didn't it? Guess you should go home, huh? Alright, you don't have to say it. Don't want to walk home by yourself, huh? Well, you're gonna make me. Yes. Let's go. Alright, so... Kind of the same stuff. Um... I'm gonna ask. No spoilers, but there is one thing I do want to know. Um... In this bad ending route, does anything happen in the school's dark world? Or should I just go straight home? Go visit Ruby? Okay. Oh wait, he's here. Silver Drake, huh? That's a new one. All right, what's the plan, honey? Um, maybe we could try Ice Shock? Ice on the Ice Pals boss? Uh, don't you want to try Fire Shock or something? Huh? Yeah, you're right. Here, how about letting me control for a bit? Uh, no, I'll control it myself. I'd like you to be a controller hog, honey. You feeling all right? Huh? Me? Of course. I I'm fine, Dad. I just... I fell asleep in the library and, you know, just had a weird dream. Oh well. I knew that bird brain put you to sleep. <laughs> What'd he do? Start lecturing you on his theorem? Of inequality in children's fighter games? <laughs> no, no, he... He fell asleep too. Wow, he even put himself to sleep. <laughs> uh, yeah, I guess so. Well, sounds like... You've been hitting the books too hard. Why don't you go home and hibernate? I'll see you tomorrow at church. Dad, are, are you gonna be okay to go? Of course! Uh, you take it easy, honey. Okay then, yeah, I'll go home and rest. Yeah, so many Smash references is funny. And just Yoshi. Toby really likes Yoshi. See you tomorrow, honey. Bye, Dad. Love you. Uh, Chris? Chris, uh, what are you doing here? Oh, if I know. Susie! Oh, this is Susie. Susie, nice. Heard a lot about you. Have? Uh, cool, I think I have to go now. Uh, Susie, huh? Yeah. Lay a finger on her and I'll kick your ass. Huh? <laughs> Just kidding. Well, kind of kidding. Sorry, I used up a lot of my energy just now. Probably not going to be very fun to talk to. Thanks for visiting, though, Chris. You too, Susie. Look, Chris, can't say much, but... Noelle might look like she has it all, but her mother... Her mother, you know. Love her, but she's tough on her. Normally, I balance it all out, but... I can't do much when I'm not there. I'm going to get better. I have to. Hey, Susie, mind if I have a word with you for a sec? Okay, cool, Master. Yeah, I'll, I'll go check that out. Uh, guess I'll be here a sec, Chris. Okay, this is different. Come 
Come on, it was just a bad dream. And so, it's so real. I can't get it out of my mind. That voice telling me what to do. Voice unlike Chris's. Terrifying voice. Chris. Recently, done something different about them. Why hasn't anyone else noticed it? I have to figure it out. Why Chris is acting so strange? Why they keep coming to the hospital? What should I say? I'm debating on to see you. Huh? Chris, how long have you been standing there? You, uh, really scared me, you know? I keep it together in a while. Nothing to be afraid of. After all, dream is just a dream. Right? Chris? Why are you wearing my watch? Oh, when did you... Alright, should I dot 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 or in your dream? I should dot dot dot. Hey, Chris, let's beat it already. Man, he kept telling me about Noelle, like... Favorite things? Places she'd like to go? No idea what the hell that was about. So, uh... How are you two doing? Oh, uh... Nothing, Susie. I, uh, I was about to go home, uh... See you! She's afraid of me again, huh? Man, would be nice. You know that everything happened was real, huh, Chris? Dude, what the fuck did you guys do? Come on, try and be a little more enthusiastic. So yeah, the watch is equipped on Noel, and you just equip it. Alright, so... All right, so let's go talk to the queen. So this is your castle town. It's magnificent. Population density is so wonderfully low. Bet the Swatchlings will love this. Where are the Swatchlings, anyhow? The task manager. Or even regular task. Hey Chris, uh, where is everyone else? Don't worry, Queen. I'm here! Me and only me! Well, I guess I'll, uh, go to my room. <laughs> Chris, I bet a lot of people. Oh, but you have a lot of people to talk to. Oh, yeah, but. Yeah, don't have to do everything at once. Take a break, save the game. Yeah, Rosie has. Or knows about saving. Actually, yeah. Uh, hey, hey, Trashy. Oh boy, oh boy, I'm Trashy. Bet I'm gonna make a lot of new friends. Well, not if I kill them all. Alzi will soon set up .exe my room for me upstairs. Do not worry. I have a long spreadsheet of my demands ready. So, even if I have an awesome room, I will be there to force to enjoy it. I wonder how Noelle is doing now. Alright, so you guys don't think there's anything new? Like everything else is just kind of like the way it is? Like, 
that that's kind of just it. Oh yeah, Lancer. Lancer wasn't... Oh wait. I'm actually just gonna go see if Lancer's in his room. We never... Yeah, that's weird that Sans doesn't change. There, I doubt he'll be over here, but... Oh, wait. Something is glimmering in the hole. Look inside. Reached inside and found something alongside a strange piece of glass. Oh. Okay. I guess I got the javel weapon. Oh, wait. The music shop isn't built. No, Chief, if you recruit enough fans for us, I'd be able to make our music shop again. And we might even give you a discount. This place is a great deal. All kinds of new customers. Wait, I missed... I missed the jet. Wait, you can get the Jebel weapon on a fresh file? Oh, hey. Lancer, hey. Lancer, how are you feeling? 100%, my purplish pal. Are you sure? I'm breathing kind of heavy. <laughs> Just a little winded from jumping from Chris's pocket. Feel free to clown around. I'll be in your items. No idea what you mean, but sure. Okay. Can you always get the Jebel weapon on a fresh file? Like right there? Alright, so I think that's the extent of the new stuff. Yeah, because I chose to not use my chapter one data uh, like when starting this fresh file. Chris is going home? Yeah. Alright. Guess it's goodbye for today. See you tomorrow, Chris. Alright, yeah, so I think this is all gonna be the same. Chris, how was studying with your... Uh, Chris, is that your friend? Why don't you invite her inside? I mean, uh... Chris, I should, uh, probably be going in. Going to bake you a pie? Want any? I guess I can come over for a bit. I'm pretty sure all this end dialogue is going to end up being the same. Feel free to come in. Oh, excuse me. I am Chris's mother, Toriel. Uh, yes, ma'am. I remember. Oh, you do? You are Susie, are you not? You uh, remember my name, too? Of course. Alphys is a good friend of mine. She often talks about you. I'm glad to hear it. What the hell is Alpha saying about me? Susie, why don't you go over there and wash your hands? Then we can make the pie together. Make it together? I don't know how to. Don't worry, I can teach you. Okay. Chris, Susie seems like a nice girl. Very happy you are friends with her, but... Chris, I heard from Alpha that... Or about her behavior. By any chance she, uh... Influences you. Leave the chalk alone, all right? My hands uh, washed. Wonderful. Now we can. Oh, Chris. How about you? <laughs> you show Susie how to bake it. Chris, you know how to make pie? 
the hell? You haven't made me anything, dumbass. You pie hoarding pizza. Oh, I mean, uh, excuse me, ma'am. Busy, you can just call me Toriel outside of school. Oh, okay, sweet. Chris, uh, you need to wash your hands too. I suppose I shall teach Susie for now. Susie and I will start getting ready to make the pie. Uh, we will? Uh, wait. I think I think this is all gonna be very uh, very similar. I think it's probably gonna play out the same way. Cause it's like I'm just thinking, like, man, if you do this in a route. Like, how things can change in coming chapters. Like, Birdly is just gonna be fucking dead. Let's get the flower. That's uh, this bag and you just, oh, you got flour on your nose. Yeah, I meant to do that. Thought you would uh, stop to smell the flower, eh? <laughs> uh, chew. come on. Now on to the next part. So uh, where the heck is Chris? Oh, Chris does this sometimes. They should hurry, I'm getting sleepy. You know what they call a sleeping Susie? What? A snoozy. <laughs> then, I guess you'd be a Snoriel then. <laughs> Snoriel. Newsy and Snoriel. Hey, I really like that one, huh? <laughs> Wasn't it funny? Alright, where the hell is Chris? I is nearly done. Oh, the sugar. Wait here a moment. I left it in the car. Okay. Tried to move the heart there. Hey, you know, Chris just, uh, need to get some fresh air. Oh, no big deal. I have a feeling all this is gonna be the same, but. Hey, Chris, hurry up next time. We're already almost done. So, what's next? Uh, the pie? Uh, we've already worked quite hard, have we not? How about we finish it later? Okay. Then, uh, I guess I'll just walk home. Oh, uh, no, 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 there's no need to do that. Actually, Izzy, would you want to stay over? Huh? I mean, if, if it's okay, then. Here, look at this. The couch is being used as a bed. Not perfect, but uh, we could all sleep it out here. Uh, that sounds good to me, yeah. Blended. I'll make sure everything's in order. Uh, just call your parents, will you not? Yeah, of course. What the hell? Sleepover? Damn, haven't had one of those in forever. Hey, Chris, it's not like someone has to tell you to sit, right? There, chill out for a sec. So, now what? Got it between the pillows here. <laughs> there, you know I'd find the remote. You can always find a good stuff wedged in the couch. Jeez, it's dusty. When'd you last use this thing? Uh, who cares? Let's just watch the TV. What are we gonna marathon tonight? Blood Crush 3, Hellbuster, Invasion of the Cat Petters. <laughs> Maybe I see the movies more your speed, huh, Chris? <laughs> 
Been a good day, huh? You, Ralsei, Lancer, everyone? What about Noel? <laughs> it's, uh, it's cool hanging out together, right? Well, you know, do you think we should try and have them come to our world? Come on, think about how much better it would be. Ralsei could do our homework, Lancer could live under your bed, we could all walk to school together. It'd be perfect, you know? I mean, we'd be unstoppable, is what I'm saying. Yeah, let's do it. Yeah, that's the attitude. Uh, what if Ralsei became a teacher's pet, though? Or not if. Feels like it's a matter of time. Well, whatever. As long as he brings me an apple, too. What? Apple shampoo? No, I, I didn't drink any of that. Well, whatever. Let's just get back to watching. So the festival's coming up, right? Thing where the town becomes a carnival? Stupid, right? But say you had to uh, take someone. Noel or Rousey. Alright, so I said you last time. I'm gonna say Noel this time. What? Why are you saying it's so confused? Oh, like anything weird I meant. You know what? Forget it. Look, let's just go back to watching the TV. Yo, hope you've been good, Swussy. Now this is what I'm talking about. Giant monster movie special. Always liked them better than the giant human movies. Now this is something we can marathon. You ready, Chris? For 12 hours of building, bashing, car cr crunching action? We are locked in, got it. Better not see you move until your eyes are bloodshot. <laughs> now let me just get comfortable here and... There. Nap time. Is he fell asleep? Yo, it's going good, Swussy. You know, just finishing up the sort of like genocide route of chapter two. Seeing if anything's different at the very end. I think it's gonna play out the same, but I'll have to see. Officer, officer. Thank goodness, I finally got through. Thought I saw someone prowling around outside. When I checked our car, tires looked like they'd been slashed. Officer, if you could please come over. Oh, you will soon? Thank you. Oh, uh, chap chapter two! It's been fucking great. It, like, I didn't expect it to be as, like, meaty as it was. They're already asleep. You know, it's, it, it's like, double or triple the size of chapter one, so that's, uh... It's really cool. And we have five more chapters to look forward to. And though, like, Toby said that this is probably the longest chapter. But, like... Yeah, I don't know. Alright, can I move the heart? The heart does not move. Move the heart out of the couch. Nope. That's a wonderful idea. Yeah, it's like, since chapters 3 through 5 are releasing at the same time, apparently... Can I move the heart? Nope. Um... It is gonna be a wait. But also, Toby redesigned a lot of the engine for chapter 2 to get a lot of stuff working. You know, like, that's why this one's also, like, more cinematic. Um... So I feel like a lot more of the work can be spent on the content i don't know well we'll see what development's like also shouts out to let rain being in the credits and i completely missed it last time Uh, 
Oh, let's see, where is it? Yep, Lena Rain. Hog. See any sort of uh secret text at the end. So one thing I wonder is like Noel. If we make Noel crazy in chapter two, how is that gonna affect the other chapters? Unless if and also Birdley's dead. So what if, what if Noelle's just like out of the party, out of the story in future chapters? S like, or I don't know. It'll be interesting to see if there's Noelle implications in chapter three and beyond. Um, or if it's just a thing where like Noelle's not even really a part of chapter three, so she can go crazy. Um, I don't know. I don't know.